System on that car. That guy's literally just driving around. Don't even waste your ammo, bro. Oh my god, yo, someone clip all this. Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy JR here bringing guys another Call of Duty Modern Warfare video. In today's video, we are going to be going over the most unstoppable MP5 class up. And oh my god, this thing is just absolutely overpowered. It doesn't matter how many times they nerf the MP5, it's still going to be one of the best weapons, if not the best weapon in the game. And for surely, the best SMG in the game. So, before we get into today's video, if you guys could do me a couple things before we build this class up, let's hit that subscribe button right now, guys, especially if you guys are new to the channel. Turn on bell notifications to the channel and drop a like on this video right now, guys. All right, now that you guys have done all those things, let's get right into the class up. So, the class up that we're going to be using in today's video is going to start off right here, and it's going to be the monolithic integral suppressor. So, a lot of people like to run the monolithic suppressor by itself on the muzzle. I personally don't. I feel like the monolithic integral suppressor is a lot better. It's going to have a built-in suppressor, obviously, and it's going to increase your bullet velocity, which means your bullets are going to travel faster and farther with more damage on them. The only downside about the barrel is it is going to decrease your ADS speed, but honestly, you guys aren't going to really feel that. So we're going to throw that on right away. Next thing we're going to be running is the FSS Close Quarter Stock. So this stock right here is actually really overpowered. It helps with your ADS speed. If you guys don't want to run it, you guys don't have to. I personally enjoy the stock, though. It helps me with a lot of my gunfights. And uh, as a matter of fact, with this stock on and in this class up that we're going to show you guys today, I actually dropped a nuke on stream today on Ground War with this exact class setup. So let's keep that in mind. So we're going to be running the FSS Close Quarter Stock. And then we're going to go to the Ender Barrel. We're going to be running the Merc Foregrip, guys. So the Merc Foregrip is going to increase your recoil control, hit fire accuracy. If you guys don't like the Merc Foregrip, you guys can always run the Commando Foregrip as well, which is not going to take away any of your ADS speed. It will help with recoil stabilization and aiming sub ability. But the Merc Foregrip is better for the up and down vertical recoil. So honestly, with SMGs, the Merc Foregrip is the foregrip to run. Now the next attachment is going to be kind of surprising. We're not going to be running the 10 millimeter auto 30 round mags. Instead, we're going to be running the 45 round mags. And you guys might be asking me why. And the answer is simple, guys. I don't have to like to have to constantly reload. Plus, 10 millimeter mags got nerfed. And the 45 millimeter round mags are honestly nice. I mean, you guys can just absolutely feed. You don't have to reload all the time. I'm able to get like four or five kills easily without having to reload, which is super nice. You're going to see that in the, some of the video here today. So it's honestly really nice having these mags on. And the very last attachment is going to be up to you guys. You guys can either run rubberized or simple grip tape on this gun, or you guys can run fast hands. I believe in today's video, I was actually running sleight of hand, which is fast hand, same thing. And uh, it's pretty much going to help you reload faster. So honestly, the sleight of hand perk is a really big boost for this SMG. 
uh it's honestly worth running especially if you're running shipment really good on shipment you're gonna be really loading a lot as you know and uh honestly side of hand is perfect for that so in today's video guys we're gonna be dropping 148 kills i believe with the mp5 on shipment it gets some sweats unfortunately no nuke in today's video but like i said if you guys tuned into today's stream you guys would have seen i actually dropped a nuke on stream on uh quarry so it's honestly a pretty good class setup i use i was using the exact same class setup and then uh, a couple matches later, I actually choked on another like 24 kill streak, unfortunately. So it's a really good class setup, guys. And I definitely think you guys should try it out. Anyways, guys, I'm out. Deuces. <laughs>
Son of a bitch, they've been all pushed that way. <laughs> I, dude, I think that, I actually think that they may have weakened Battle Hardened, dude. Like, I get stunned way more than I did before. I think they weakened it and didn't tell us. What's the score? Okay. Holy fucking hit markers, y'all. Y'all see that? He dropped. I just got so many hit markers there, it's not even funny, dude. Oh my god. Almost got me there with that shotty, buddy. I try a little bit harder. You've got to be kidding me! I cannot catch a break this match. He's trying to drop shot me. Uh uh, get out of here. What mastery challenge did I just complete? I'm curious. I can't see, bro. The battle harder needs to be patched or fixed. It needs to be fixed. There's no reason that I should be getting blind like that by a stun. I'm sorry. First thing every time he spawns in is to throw a grenade, I think. Like, my lord, bro, you ever gonna quit throwing grenades? Oh, they all spawned right there. There's a mine in the middle of nowhere. Okay, see if we're gonna hurt this kid. I I look you should have nuked this lobby and it irritates me. Cause this is this is a good lobby, bro. I don't get lobbies like this all the time. Oh shit man. Usually my He's drawn me on me. Next time I'm gonna play a little bit slower. This man has thrown so many grenades at me, it's not even funny. And he's behind me as a teammate's watching that way. Literally, as soon as this kid spawns in, all he does is throw a grenade. That's literally all he does as soon as he spawns in.
I'm not even close to it. Oh, boy. <laughs> 